In this brass cup sits Vasudeva with his son Lord Krishna seated in his lap. There is a hole in the base of the cup. When we fill some water in the brass cup, the water does not drain out. But as we keep adding more water, the water only drains when its level reaches Krishna's foot. Here you can see water being drained out from the hole below the cup. Once it starts, the whole water drains out from the cup. Now we will try and solve the mystery behind this cup. Through a simple science experiment, here you can see a small hole where Krishna is sitting. For this, we will need a big CD box, a bottle, a bendable stro straw, glue and a scissors. Now first make a big hole in the base of the jar. The shape of this hole should be as shown. The big hole has a small notch. Cut the bottle in half and make a small notch as shown. The bottle must fit snugly in the big jar hole. Also the bottle notch must match the notch at the base of the jar. On inverting the jar, the bottle will look like this. Seal the joint with rubber glue to prevent any leakage of water. Then cut a bent straw as shown and glue it on the notch. Now glue this joint too. Wait for a while for the glue to dry up. Then extend and stretch the bent straw by pulling it and insert it in the bottle as shown. The model is now ready for experimenting. Stick a picture of Krishna so that its feet reach the top of the bent straw. Now add colored water to the jar. Keep adding water until its level just reaches the bend in the straw. At this moment, once the level of water reaches the bend of the straw, it will drain out of the straw because of siphon. This experiment will help you understand the principle behind the mysterious Krishna's cup. Okay. Hallelujah.